Hey, I'm back with another review. This review is more of a challenge. If you're familiar with the fire noodle challenge, there is this Korean noodle, ramen noodle package you can get. It's supposed to be the hottest, if not one of the hottest, ramens you can get. So what I've done is I've cooked up my noodles. There's nothing in them. Um, it says to take out most of the water. There's just a little bit of water on the bottom of this bowl. But then I'm going to add the flavorings that it comes with. This is the spicy sauce. According to the package, I believe it says somewhere between um, 4,000 to 10,000 Scoville heat units. And then underneath that it says 4,404 Scoville heat units. So. Since I can't read all the other Korean parts of that, I'm not sure exactly what number to go on, but it's at least 4,000. And let's put that sauce right on there. Make sure I get it all on the package. It does have a very strong smell to it, but it smells like chicken. It is a spicy chicken flavor. So I'm going to mix that up in there. Sauce with the noodles. Everywhere. So I've seen a lot of other people do this challenge. I don't know if I'm going to videotape myself eating the whole thing. Because that might take too long. But we'll just see how it goes. Okay, I think that's on everything. And then they give you another packet that has some kind of dry seasoning to it. We're going to put that on top. Looks like sesame seeds. Looks like sesame seeds and little pieces of seaweed. And you can see the finished product. Alright. Let's give this a try. If it gets too spicy, I still have my peanut butter soda to cool myself down with. Let's get that open just in case. I think the official challenge says not to drink anything, so we'll try to start with that and see how it goes. All right, fire noodle challenge. Here we go. <clears throat> it's definitely spicy. <clears throat> not the spiciest thing I've ever eaten in my life. But definitely up there. Should have brought a napkin. <clears throat> I can feel a really nice burn all around the inside of my lips, the inside of my cheeks, all over the back of my throat. Definitely not so spicy that I can't finish it. Play some music while I'm eating it so it's not too boring. Because I'm not going to add any music to it. <clears throat> Sorry, I was about to say something. Don't want me down my throat. It's actually really tasty. Even though it's really spicy, you still taste... Uh, the chicken part of the flavoring. It is a uh, hot temperature wise too. I just pulled this out of boiling water. Mm. 
Ooh, I really want to like blow my nose or something. Whew. Definitely don't want to drop a, a booger in here. Almost done. Just a little bit left. Alright, this is going to be like the last little bits of it. Empty. Challenge complete. Now I'm not sure if I have to wait a certain amount of time before I'm able to drink something. But since I'm not taking this challenge too seriously, I'm going to cool myself down. Ooh. It's really like enjoyably spicy, actually. Usually if something is too, too spicy, I take one bite and that's it. I get hiccups. But this one, very tasty. Even though it's spicy, even though I still feel a spice all in my mouth and lips. Anyway, I actually really like this. The noodles were a nice texture. The flavor was good. This is definitely like a nine and a half out of ten ramen. I have two more packages of this. Well, I had two more packages of this. I gave one to my wife, and I gave one to my friend. Uh, if you're watching this, tell me how you liked it. Um, The burn is just staying in my mouth. Anyway, that's it for this video. Until next time, bye.